Marlena, can you please introduce yourself? Good morning. I'm Marlene Ehrenberg from Mexico City, and I am an, an old guy. <laughs> All right, listen, we're, we're looking at the Reboso.wikispaces.com website, Reboso.wikispaces.com, and we're looking at how to add a link. So okay. here's what I'd like you to do. I'd like you to kind of highlight Nino Pa on your wiki page, and I'm going to show you how to add a link to the Nino Pa web page you've created. Just okay. highlight it. Now click, go up to, the, to, go up to where it says link. Okay. Now, Marlene, you created this website with your buddy Hector a while back, right? It's it's how how old is this website? Um, the Niño Pa is actually uh, recent, uh, oh. only this week. Okay. Now you see the text of the enlace is Niño Pa, but the nombre de página we're going to change that. Get rid of Niño Pa in, where it says in red, and start typing in Zochi, and we'll see what comes up. Okay. Now one second, you don't have to type it all. All of a sudden you see you have two choices, Zochi Milko, but you're already on that page. Click the second okay. link, Zochi. There you okay. go. And then you should get a green uh, check mark if it works. Click. I click there. Oh, and, very nice. Yes, it did. And now click Añadir Enlace. Add the link. Okay, and you didn't last. Wow. Look at that. That's magic. <laughs> now this is a fairly simple way for you to update information, and that's why we've been suggesting a wiki. No, it's incredible. Now here's what I'd ask you to do. Once it's saved, I'd like you to click save or guardar to save the page, this particular wiki this particular wiki page. I did it. All right. Okay. Now we're recording this. Uh, right. We're recording this so that other people can learn and that you can come back to this. Uh, can I ask you something? Please. Um, for instance, there is um, a boat which we call in Mexico Trajinera with my name, and there are a few people on it. Can you, in Wiki, put the names of the people that are on the trajinera or boat? You know what I would suggest, what I would suggest, one second, let's go up to the very top of your page, by the way. What I would suggest is that instead of adding the photo as, um, as just a photo, as, as just had it adding the photo, to okay. embedding the photo uh, using Flickr. Now, Top left, do you see where it says Cambios Recientes? See, sí, and I let's see click, 17. Let's click Cambios Recientes. Okay. Who designed the wiki? It's wonderful. Wow. Okay. Now let's look at the changes that we made today. Uh, you've created uh, the Nino Pa page. And you've been editing the Xochimilco page. Yes. Okay. And again, this is one easy way for people to keep track of what's new. Okay. Yes, that's excellent to know. Can you click the pestaña Xochimilco Niño Pa? Um, it's the lower one. No, no, no. The uh, I'm sorry, on Flickr. The pestaña, the tab. Uh, upstairs, yes. Okay. I click it. See, the suggestion I'd have, you know, you can add text, you can add, you can easily add text to the page, but, you know, for example, here you have the code for this page, right. and then make sure that the pictures you have of other people, make sure that they have uh, a description on the Flickr page, and that would, that would be the solution to the question you asked. Ah, uh, okay. All right. That's good, because sometimes I take them from my personal album and not necessarily from Flickr. Right. So the idea would be put it in Flickr, tag it, and then put it in the widget or whatever. Right, in the wiki, exactly. And again, to repeat that process. Hey, thank you much.